Okay, everybody, this is what we're going to do. We are going to go ahead uh, west from here, from our house, and we're going to head along the wall, all the way along the wall, and we're going to go, you know the barrows up here? Let me go ahead and just, uh, just show you right here in the map. These are the barrows. We're going to go over here to the barrows, and we're going to go kill the barrow king. You want demon blood? We'll show you where you get the most demon blood in this map. Oh, pigs. Yeah. More pigs. More pigs. What the? Wow. Pig pigs. It's a bacon fest, man. Pigs everywhere. Oh, those rabbits scared me. <laughs> Crack rabbits. <laughs> rabbits. You know, it'd be nice if we could just, I mean, if they just put in like one animal that you can tame. Just one. Yeah. So we can test it out. So we can try it out. I don't, I don't want all the animals at once. Just let me tame just one. You can tame it. An antelope. Uh, uh, no. A rabbit. <laughs> you, a rabbit, and you can't ride it. It's like, no. Uh, we got a pig spawn to the left. Oh, is, it, is this the place where the pigs flew? Maybe. Yeah, I think it was. <laughs> there you go. They're going to get a flying goat. Or that's a flying boar right there. See it? Do you see it? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> oh, there it goes. He, he stopped. He's just lost. See, Montegard, like I said, we don't need no stinking bedrolls. <laughs> Not till we get there. Yeah, you say that as I've got a wolf chasing me. Do you really? Yeah, Why'd I you heard say him snapping something? at me. Uh, well, I, he isn't on me. I don't know oh. where he's at. I heard oh. him snapping behind me, but I think I lost him. Okay. I just thought it was funny because you said that just as I heard this teeth gnashing. Yeah, should I get, should we get the, the box that only appears when you swim? Uh, yeah, I mean, the safest way is to swim across anyway. So. That's true. Oh, you go, you got wolves behind you. So, guys, this this right here, see, there's a ghost, uh, ghostly apparition right here. And when you swim across, he shows up and he's swimming. And he's, uh, and then just give it a second. There's another ghost apparition on the other side. He's got a crossbow. He shoots the guy. He shoots him. And down the guy goes. Right, there is not a chest here right now, but there will be in a second. It's all of his loot. They fell to the bottom of the lake after he drowned, after he was shot. It's really cool. There it is. And what do we got? Uh, a bunch of crap. There's some glowing goop and some cooked meat, though. This is glitched down here. You gotta, you, you can easily drown if you get stuck. There's no water in the bottom, but you can't breathe down there either, so. Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. I see a pig up ahead. Pig! Is he on me? Yes. Yeah, he's on me. Dang it. I didn't want to go this way. All right, there's the barrows, guys, at sunset. Isn't it beautiful? It's gorgeous. It actually is pretty cool looking. Filled with the dead. Okay, that's another. Is that a bear? That's a bear. Yes. We can't be here. Uh, bears and darkness in us don't get along. We're just going to keep skirting right here. We're going to skirt the southern edge. Let me show you the map. This is where we're at right now. We're right here. We're right below it. We're just skirting it. We're going to go west. We're going to go on the western western side of the barrows. So just keep heading this way. Just follow the wall all the way down. This is how you get to where we're going to go. He says mysteriously. Is there? Yeah. There's hops right there, by the way. I never noticed it before. These are all hops. It's like I thought that looked familiar. You guys don't, well, no, you, you don't know. You need hops to make ale. Um, I think it's ale, right? I think so, yeah. And then that is your basis for the, all the rest of the specialty drinks. So, so yeah, and I didn't know there was hops right there. There really, there's hops almost everywhere in the south. Look at all those hops plants down there. I'm gonna go get them. Oh, or should I? It's a bear. It's dark. I know. We'll wait. We'll wait. We we'll just sit here and chill till it gets light. Yeah, I see a light over there. It's one of them 
Uh, are you talking about up on the hill or down in the barrel? Down in the, down in, uh, down, I thought maybe it was one of, oh yeah, it's one of the undead. Yep. It's one of them glow in the dark pajama skeletons. Pajama skeletons. <laughs> they look like they're wearing glow in the dark skeleton pajamas. Alright, it's getting light. I think we're getting close to being able to go out. Okay. But I want to go grab this hops. I think these are hops, aren't they? Maybe not. Maybe it just looked like hops in the, in the fading light. Those wolves. Yeah, there's always wolves. No, these aren't hops. What am I doing? We need to go down this way anyway, though. Yep. There's is hops it, down here. Is there? Mm -hmm. Where are you? I went down. You went up, and I went down. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, cool. Hops. I found hops. Nice. Hello. Mr. You don't ever do damage to me, and I can't kill you. Alright, these guys are going to be annoying, but I think we can bypass most of them. Is that a bear? That's a pig. It's a wolf. It's another wolf. Let me go up. Oh, I'm oh I'm freezing. Oh, shoot. Yeah. That's not good. Then think about that. We had, Did we have fur armor on last time? I don't think so. It's oh. only when you get up in the hills that it's cold, and we don't need to stay up. So. Oh, true. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't want to fall on the head of a dire wolf. Come here, puppy. Oh, here, I'll kill him. And where are you? I slid down the hill. I'm working my way around. Okay, I see you. You're ahead of me. Okay, so we we're going to the very furthest west of the part, western part of the map. And I'm going to skirt this area right here. Because if you step on that, I'm surprised Monogard didn't trigger him. Like a whole bunch of the undead show up. What are you doing, Monogard? I'm trying to... They're, they're after me. And they're annoying. Did you walk through the through the middle? No, I Did went around the up? edges, but they were already out. Oh, okay. Well, these they are the guys you want to avoid, guys. Well, let's let's cut him back, and we'll cut him away. That's where the Demon King resides, y'all. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Everybody. Everybody. I'm talking to you. Talking to you. Talking to you. They can't hurt you, but they can be annoying as hell. Yeah, they've got knockback and all kinds of annoying yeah, things that stupid. get in their way. All right, we're gonna we're just gonna kite him, kite him down, and then we're gonna we're gonna climb a hill and get away from him. We can just go down this way; it's fine. There's only so many of them that spawn, so I'm thirsty. Come on, kitties, let's go. So, oh, you know what? I bet you we just step right through. Or maybe not. I don't know if they follow us into the cave or not. This might be far enough. We could probably climb up. There we go. Oh. Yeah, right here. All right, so there's the Demon King's home, and I'll show you on the map where he's at exactly. He's right there. That's where he's going to be. He's right there. Can I have some demon blood? Can you have some demon blood? I don't know if you're going to need demon blood, but I'll split, the, it, I'll split it, it with does you. Does the door roll open, or does it teleport? That's. Oh, I just dropped the whole damn thing. Okay, I took half, so you should get the, be able to get the rest. Okay, thank you. All right, so you need demon blood to open the door. And it's super freaking dark in there, so you want a torch. Hang on, let me, let me fix my torch. Do you have a torch? I do. All right, cool. All right, so here we go. Y'all ready for this? 
<laughs> okay, this is the cave of the Demon King. As of right now, before the patch, everybody, undead don't do damage. After the patch, they're going to fix it. So don't go in here thinking you're not going to get your butt kicked, because you probably will. But we have the two strong. We have the strongest uh, weapon in the game. So because uh, uh, glacier crack right here is 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 going to do the most damage. This is the most demon blood you're going to get, from what I've been told. I don't know if it's true. Where's this? Here he is, in all of his glory, the Demon King. Hi, buddy. What's up? How you doing? Oh, he wants you, Monte Guard. He didn't want me. He wants your soul. Kill him. You have your dagger on you? Yes. Cool. I'm going to let you harvest him. Oh, just so you know, guys. Uh, it took... Oh, it didn't take any... Oh, wait. It didn't take any demon blood to get in here. It just needed it on your person. Ah, uh, okay. That was easy. He's dead. Wait, can't stop before you, before you harvest him. I haven't done anything yet. Screenshot. All right, good. Okay. Thumbnail right. for later. She's going to use her... Da what dagger are you using? It's Star Metal Dagger. Star Metal Dagger. Should harvest the most blood, we think. So far, all I'm getting is hide. All right, I would use your uh, use your pick then. Boom. There demon blood. Go. Demon blood. Okay, I don't okay. know how, how much did you get. 45. You got 45? I got 56. So... 100? Actually, 35, because I already had 10. It was counting the 10. 35, people. really? Yeah. So 90, not quite 100. Yeah. I expected a lot more. I did too. What's this? Nothing? There's got to be something else in this cave besides him. Over here. Where is it? Where Where? Where are you? Right here. Oh, hold <laughs> on. Let me get back. Here I am. Oh, Okay. There we go. Learn new recipes. Okay. What are they? Do we know? I believe that that is the recipe for the um, the Kingslayer polearm. The, the <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the best the best polearm in the game. Yes. Yeah, it's like the, the most... I think it's the best weapon in the game, actually, isn't it? I'm not sure. I well, haven't seen the stats on it, but we're going to find out. Oh, yeah. We're going to go back and make this. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a spear, guys. Boom. Where is it? Star metal. Kingslayer pole arm. We need 30 hardened steel bars, 8 shaped wood, and 10 leather, which we have in here. I just need 30 hardened steel bars. We have 28. I need two more. All right. The Kingslayer pole arm. Let's see what it looks like. Health damage 99. Want a guard? Armor penetration forty six. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty cool. Like a little scimitar on a stick. <laughs> what? It made me think of corn dogs for some reason. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, why did it make you think of corn dogs? on a stick. All right, for science. Oh, hold on, let me uh Yeah, I'll let you do it. Yeah, I'll let you I'll let you hit me. It's fine. Oh, okay. Um boop. Oh, it didn't drop it. All right, so it says 99, but then again, uh it says glacier crack is 93. So, an armor penetration 70. So, this does more damage than glacier crack does. So, it might be one of the most damaging weapons in the game. So drop it. Boop. There you go. There you go, Miss Pointy Stick. Okay, hang Ready? on. No. Take your off. Oh my goodness. Time to get naked. I get. I have to take. I have to put some things away. All right. It says 99. I'm at 584, guys. So the and what's your strength right now, Monteguard? 30. 30. I gotta eat. Hang on. 
you just <laughs> you're like you're like okay. all right that was funny all right so all right so go ahead and hit me whenever you're ready okay here we go regular attack 452 out of five ah uh, wait that's not right 452 from 584 eight 132. All right. Uh, go ahead. Over a power attack. Okay. Power attack. Whoops. I wasn't close enough. <laughs> <laughs> 386. Wow. So that's 198. Is it? Yeah. Is that right? You did 198 points of damage? No. 386. I guess it is. It's 198 points of damage on a power attack. Yeah. Holy mackerel. <laughs> That's really good. That's really good. Can I have my weapon back now, please? I'm just kidding. You can I, have I it don't want it. I don't like pole okay. arms. I don't care about that. Um, that's 200 points of damage in your hands, nearly. Yeah. You should be able to. You should be able to kill. Try going out here. I, go out. Let me let me put my clothes back on. I want you to go out there and see if you can kill a regular wolf in like two hits. It's five hits normally with the sword. I mean with with glacier crack. So let's test that sucker out. Yeah. You might be able to take on a bear. Because of the distance, oh. what? We should have reset our beds before we came out here. I'm not the one fighting. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see any wolves. Try the boar. Right. You, as long as you get get the first lick in, and you and you can circle around. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? What Four hits. Four? Four. Hmm. They have 800 health or 700 and change? Yeah. I know they have a lot of health because they're a pain to take yeah. down. Well, that is the Barrow King and the Kingslayer Polearm in action. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you saw anything you liked, please give us a thumbs up. And if you are brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.